Welcome back. Here are some of the other top business headlines that we're tracking here on uh, In Business. One of the country's uh, biggest fast food companies may soon be slimming down. Um, we're going to bring you the details of that with Nelson Peltz, the group's largest investor. He wants the company to focus. Alman has a drug he says can revolutionize the treatment of diabetes. Next. Session hour from the close over in Europe and take a look at what's happening in the U.S. equity trade despite that much better than expected existing home sales figure for December that came out just 30 minutes ago. We are seeing the markets continue to decline. Uh, tech stocks noticeably so the Nasdaq down seven tenths right now. You had already seen declines there um, and we're equity movers and plenty of them get buzzed about on the blogosphere before they make it to the big. Talk to me about the, the health and the future of mankind, because not getting approval for a drug is obviously hurtful. Right. Well, and the FDA didn't outright reject it. They said we need more studies. Well, this is the second time the FDA has asked mankind for more studies. So now, Al yeah, Man, uh, right. And he says he's going to go forward with it. He says, you want the studies? I'll do them. I'll keep going forward. He's invested a billion dollars of his own money. All right. <laughs> All right, Shen. Thank you very much. Meantime, commercial property value fell 8.4% in New York City last year year, but real estate experts are predicting more 